Greetings class, my name is Marco Contreras and I'll present to you Spina Bifida. What is Spina Bifida? The name comes from the Latin, Spina which means spine, Bifida which means split, therefore we get split spine. Spina Bifida is a condition that results from a failure of the neural tube to close on its distal end. It is the most common neural tube defect in pregnancies, also known as NTD. The spinal cord fails to form properly during the first month of pregnancy. The spinal cord and all the nerves are exposed on the fetuses or the baby's lower back. Often the new name should assist on the lower back where the abnormality is. On the picture on the right, we observe spina bifida and its three types. From left to right, spina bifida occulta, meningocele, and myelomeningocele. What is the cause of spina bifida? There is no true known cause for this abnormality. However, there are two theories about the cause. One, genetic factors, also known as heredity, and two, environmental factors which includes the mom's diet during pregnancy, which should include folic acid. Folic acid. Folate, the actual vitamin, allows the body to be able to create DNA and other genetic materials, cells to divide, and in pregnancy, the aids in neural tube closure. Women must take 400 micrograms prior to and on the first month of pregnancy in order to prevent spina bifida. Types of spina bifida. There are three known forms of spina bifida: spina bifida occulta, meningocele, cell, and myelo meningo cell. Spina bifida occulta is the most common, and out of a thousand birds, one of them will have spina bifida. Spina bifida occulta, also known as hidden spina bifida, it is a gap between one or more vertebrae. In most cases, it causes no harm and visible signs are unnoticed. Sometimes the nerves between the gaps may have a progressive neurological deterioration that develops later in life. 50% of the world's population have it unknown. Meningocele Part of the spinal cord is pushed out through the spine as a sac. The sac is filled with cerebral spinal fluid. The sac may be simply filled with the fluid, and the spinal cord stays in place. If this is the case, there will be no result in paralysis. Usually there is no nerve damage, but when there is, some of these people will have disabilities, such as mildly impaired movement from the hips down. They may develop hydrocephaly and or bowel and bladder problems. Myelomeningocele, also known as spina bifida cystica. It is the most severe form of spina bifida. It occurs when part or all of the spinal cord and or nerves come through the opening of the spine. It causes severe damage and other disabilities. 70 to 90 percent develop hydrocephalus because of arnold chiari malformation, which is when the hairbrain extends, descends, or herniates into the spinal cavity where black cerebral spinal fluid drainage and its circulation. This causes pressure and swelling inside the head. Any nerve damage done by parturition will be permanent. Disabilities of myelomeningocele Paralysis, orthopedic issues, bowel and or bladder problems, learning disability, nervous system is susceptible to infection, loss of skin sensation, and sexual impotence in adults. Diagnosis In utero, it is diagnosed through an ultrasound or an amniocentesis. In adults, it is found via x-rays. This is because 
the patient may go to get an x-ray for other reasons in their vertebrae and they find that they have spina bifida occulta. Treatment There is no cure for this congenital malformation. However, it could be treated. In spina bifida occulta, treatment is not often necessary. For the other forms of spina bifida, surgery is performed to remove the cyst. In myelomeningocell, surgery must be performed within the first day of parturition to prevent any more damage to the neural tissues. The pictures at the bottom show different procedures done to correct spina bifida. Thank you guys and girls for watching my presentation. If you're interested in more information about spina bifida, feel free to click on the links to find out more.